Hello, welcome. Welcome back if you're a current subscriber. Welcome if you're new. All right, so I actually got a surprise box here from Harper James. Mary is the owner. I got this today and was a little surprised because I had a packaging of clothing that my friend, um, I've told you before, my friend uh, has a shop in downtown LA. She makes all of her clothing on a dead stock fabric which is super awesome. It's helping save the environment. And she employs people in the US in downtown LA to make the clothing. So I had a package coming from her and I saw this underneath it and I was like, what the heck? And Mary sent me a little package here. I did open because I was like, what did I order? So she has three more Christmas tree blends for me to smell. She's curious to hear my thoughts. Um, one of these will be offered in the pre-order, so I will reach out to her tonight and let her know which one I loved. And then she sent me another little surprise. Oh, she's so sweet. Um, I am very thankful that it, vendors reach out or like will send me things because what a blessing that is. And I'm very honored and, um, Mary is just so sweet. I love her wax. You'll see, if you saw my empties and unempties, I, at the end, I shared what I warmed through her with her. And I, I just really enjoy the performance and the presentation. Now, <laughs> I don't think she generally does loaves. <laughs> the North Pole, maybe she saw my Christmas video, scent video of me saying this is one of my favorites. And, um, I'm out of this. So it's spearmint, peppermint, and vanilla. And don't be afraid of this one because this is like the creamiest, dreamiest. Oh, so good. Oh my gosh. Mary, I love the. Oh. Okay. I don't know if she's offering lobes. <laughs> Maybe she should. Oh, this is just. This just makes my heart happy. It's like Christmas winter calming. I went to Hobby. Oh, Mary, this is so beautiful. Thank you so much. I'm going to have a hard time cutting this because it's so pretty. Um, I went to Hobby Lobby today and got the rest of my fall stuff. And then I was like, I got some Christmas stuff. But I get so emotional around Christmas time. You know, it's just a hard time of year for me. As I'm sure with everybody who has endured loss, um, packaged very well, nothing looks broken. Um, so. It's just a hard time of year, and I got emotional again missing my son. <laughs> With my other son being turning 18 and, you know, going to graduate, it's just hard for me knowing one of my kiddos is missing. Okay, I don't even know what to say. Oh, <laughs> Damn. okay, so <laughs> it looks like we have a battle. <laughs> There's Christmas tree cakes one and two. So, all right, let's look at these. So she must have done something different with these. So this is the one she's probably asking me about. Okay, that's good. Mm. Oh, I think I like two better. Yeah, two is definitely the winner. What the heck did you do in this two? Oh, this is good. Christmas tree cakes number two is it. Oh, that's good. It's yellow cake, buttercream, pastry uh, filling, but I wonder if she added like almond or something in there. I don't know. Yeah, this is good, but this smells more like yellow cake with buttercream. She must have some secret in number two because there is it almond or there's some kind of something she did extra. Oh, I like this one a lot. Oh, I wish I had a Christmas tree cakes. Are they out yet? Because I would love to know. So Mary, oh my gosh, thank you for sending that. I'm super excited. Okay. Oh, and then this one says Little Debbie. It's yellow cake, buttercream, pastry filling. So what did she do? Oh, this one's really good too. Oh, um, what the heck? I like number two and I like the Little Debbie, but they all have the same send notes. What did she do to these? Oh, this one smells different. Mm. Oh my gosh. What did she say in this? Oh, she wants me. Oh my gosh. 
I think I like Christmas tree number two. Yeah, I still like number two. Oh my gosh. But this little Debbie is good too, but there's some, maybe I get more of the, maybe there's a little spice in here. Man, wow. Okay, one is a no. That one is a no. I don't know what it is, but I something is off on number one. Number two, it's almost like there's a little bit of almond or cherry in there. It's probably almond. I like this this little Debbie. Oh, it's like I get a little bit more pastry with the buttercream and a slight hint of yellow cake. Okay, I don't know what she's going to do. I would say little Debbie I really like, and I like Christmas tree number two. And if she has the North Pole, which I believe she does, I would recommend that. You guys saw my Christmas scents. I'm going to go crazy. If you want to know what I'm going to order, reach out and let me know. And I, or I will let you know what I'm going to get. I usually order a hundred dollars because it's free shipping. I've been really good about not buying as you've seen in my hauls. They're very limited. Um, and I have been waiting for this one because I need, I know I probably don't need Christmas scents, but I do want more because I'm really trying to pinpoint which ones I love. And in my collection, there was a lot of videos or a lot of videos. No, a lot of that wax I was putting away last night. And I love her Grinchmas and oh, her gingerbread and her eggnog. I was putting away her, well, hers is still in the cart because I had, okay, it's still this fiasco. I have to fight with my credit card company or my check card company. Um, I ordered this dresser. It's not coming. I, don't, I can't get a hold of anybody. I've emailed. I've tried calling. The number doesn't work. The emails are coming back to me. So I have to fight it. So anyway, I'm going to order just a cheaper one. Otherwise, I'm looking on Marketplace. I like refurnishing old I like refurnishing old things because my dresser over there is this beautiful teal and I refinished it, put all new handles on it. My husband refinished the top for me. I haven't repainted this, but I'm going to. I've refinished the shelf here. I've refinished a shelf over there. My downstairs I made, it was this free table. I painted it red and then I put a map on the top. I like, if I can save a piece of wood from going in the fire or, you know, people trashing it. I, I like reclaimed furniture. I feel like it holds some history. I have ones I've spent $200 on just to refinish them because they're actually antique. And I don't necessarily paint them, but I do refinish the top because the tops are usually that nasty wood that's like the prime or poly they put on. It gets kind of gross. Um, so I don't generally like ruin expensive furniture because I spent, you know, $200, $300 on some pieces because I really like old furniture. So I'm I don't have my Harper James because I told you guys I'm trying to get my all my wax upstairs. I don't want it downstairs anymore. I just want to have it one place and feel like get my collection where I want it. Um, and so Harper James is still in my carts, my Michaels carts, you know, all those carts I buy. Um, I have like a ton of them, but I have it there, but I'm waiting to decide what I'm going to do for a dresser. And last night I was on Facebook marketplace and I found one. So I just need to see if my husband can go pick it up this weekend. It's like 50 bucks and it's huge. Well, it's probably the site. I think it's like a six drawer and that would be perfect for my wax. So besides my Scentsy, I don't foresee that my Scentsy is going to, I have this one in my custom closet downstairs that my husband built me, I have like all the bins. I don't foresee those coming out of there. I think my Scentsy will stay there and then my vendor wax will be up here. And then eventually I hope to get my Scentsy up here, but I got to start somewhere, right? Anyway, I will be ordering from Harper James. That is one that I've just been waiting on from her. She just finished her fall one and shipped those out. I can't wait to see what you guys all got. So if you got some, let me know. I will watch your fall videos. I'm hoping she's going to make the big Christmas trees, but I haven't seen Mary post that. I heard, I saw the other shapes. Last time when she did the fall pre-order, she did this huge pumpkins. And then I saw her do a huge Christmas tree and I was like, but maybe it comes down to shipping that because I can't imagine that's easy to ship. So I bet that's why. Like super cute, but it's probably not practical. Anyway, I'm rambling. So I'm going to post this probably today. Because her pre-order is, let's see, 20th, 20th. Yeah, her 
her pre-order is tomorrow. So I'll post this on Friday night for you guys because it is Friday for me. Um, like I said, I went and did some shopping. My son is, or, well, all my kids are going to be home soon. It is raining. So I'm going to ask my husband if he can go get that dresser for me. And I probably am going to stain it. Actually, I'm going to chalk paint it because I like, or it's a matte paint. I have this really p pretty blue gray right here. Um, I think I'm going to do it that one because the other one is like, um, turquoise and I like this bluish gray that I have because it goes well with that. So I'm going to go see if he can, him and my son can go pick it up for me. Like I said, it's like 50 bucks. It's very, it's like the right size. It's going to go here actually. I might actually just do it cream if it's going to go this way behind me because then I can put warmers on it. So anyway, I'm rambling. I hope you guys are all doing well. Mary, thank you so much again for sending me this. I really hope you pour, tell me what the difference in two and the little Debbie is because I would love to know if she responds to me. I will post it at the end of this video in a little card with that if she tells me. But she might not tell me because it's her secret, right? But whatever one she picks for the Christmas one, these are all fantastic. Wow, I'm super impressed. Anyway, I hope you guys are all doing well. And with that being said, have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Bye.